I'm starting to see things differently. I'm looking at my practice differently. I'm looking at the way I interact with students and colleagues differently because of this new understanding and this greater understanding that the nursing courses in the graduate level offer. I was finding that I had a lot of questions that I couldn't find answers for, at least not satisfactory answers. I had some ideas that I wasn't sure how to get from my mind into reality. When I was working as a clinical nurse educator, I noticed a need for specialized care for the older adult in our population, especially in Kelowna. He was having trouble with mobilization. We need to look at his. I wanted to work in an advanced practice role with gerontology, and the way to do that was to get a master's. I've worked in acute care, I've worked in rural settings, in a large city, hospitals, public health, quite a variety of areas. And I have an interest in research now, so I thought that would be the next logical step for me. Being able to attend a university in my community and having those contacts within my community to work on research and to link the practice and research communities together made a big difference for me. What we're going to do is you got the 4x4s that you're going to put on and that's what you're going to use to dab the sites. Yeah. When I first started looking at taking my masters, I really had to look at what I was doing. At that point in time I was a full-time nurse at the hospital. I was starting to do some part-time clinical work. I have a young family with three young children. There was a lot going on and I really needed to take that time and see, is this something that I want to pursue? And once I answered that question for myself, that yes, I do want my master's degree, I do want to pursue that, then it was about taking those things in my life and just restructuring that so that I could make the time for it. Last I heard, I think they were from out of town, so we don't know when they last saw them. I was a clinical nurse educator, so I was fortunate to have a Monday to Friday position, and many of my classes were later in the afternoon or on weekends. So I was able to meet that requirement of a master's for my clinical nurse specialist role when that came up. It's absolutely doable to work full time and also work on your master's. The things I have been learning in my classes have really opened my eyes to a broader sense of knowledge, broader sense of understanding of nurses in general, our role in the health profession, and what I can offer. Well, initially I was terrified because I had been out of school for a while, uh, and also it was a new centre for me. I was new to Kelowna at the time, so I think I had the same fears that everybody does coming back. It's actually been really great, better than I imagined. I find that the faculty are very encouraging. They will go out of their way to make sure that you succeed. New ideas are encouraged. That was one of my fears as well, that I thought I had some, some different ideas and how would that be received, and they were received very well. Taking the master's program has shown me how much I don't know and what I need to know in order to move forward to really embrace more of that understanding of what it means to be a nurse. What does that look like? Yeah, half an hour, 45 minutes. Get us see how she's doing in our everyday life, whether we're in the hospital, we're in the community, or we're in a classroom. How can we fulfill our duties of that nursing call and pass that on to the next generation so we don't lose ourselves in a system so that we can maintain the core values of who we are and our passion for why we went into this profession in the first place. If you have a desire to further your education, you just gotta do it.